the head of Boeing is admitting that his company is to blame for a mid-air scare last week on a commercial flight out of Portland, Oregon. In a video addressed to company employees, CEO David Calhoun said the mistake can never happen again. He's talking, of course, about the mid-air blowout of a so-called door plug on a Boeing-made 737 MAX 9 jet that left a gaping hole in the fuselage. Investigators are looking into whether loose bolts are to blame. National correspondent Morris Sirianni joining us now with the latest on the uh, ongoing uh, fallout. And again, the, the public part of all this is that hundreds of flights are getting canceled until they can find out what's going on uh, with these planes. So if you're flying Alaska or United, you got to pay attention to this story. Yeah, you certainly do. And I first want to begin because this has really been a mystery for the past, you know, since Friday. I want to begin with that mid-air scare um, on that Alaska Airlines jet because investigators say, well, they actually now know what happened on board uh, Flight 1282, but say they're still trying to figure out why this happened. So officials with the NTSB say guide tracks on the Alaska Airlines Boeing 737 MAX 9 jet's door plug were fractured and that so far they have not been able to recover four bolts that were meant to secure that very door plug and prevent it from moving upward. We then know what happened. It peeled off, uh, really flew off the jet. So the question now they're trying to answer is were those four bolts ever even installed in the first place. They're looking to Boeing now uh, to answer that. So all of this, of course, adding to the mounting pressure on Boeing to really answer to widespread safety concerns. Tuesday, they held a company-wide uh, safety webcast in which Boeing CEO David Calhoun, he acknowledged that a mistake was made and said that this can never happen again, adding, quote, while we've made progress in strengthening our safety management and quality control systems and processes over the last few years, Situations like this are a reminder. We must remain focused on continuing to improve. He almost, uh, he also uh, promised transparency moving forward. I think that's something that everyone wants at this point. You have a lot of people who are kind of afraid to fly after what happened last Friday. So now to the grounding of those Max 9 jets. This is a big conversation here. As a precaution, the FAA says, well, it's going to extend the grounding of every 737 Max 9 with a door plug pending further inspection. So as we reported yesterday, this impacts 171 planes, but there are still 215 of those jets in service. That is because some international carriers uh, like Aeromexico operate models that don't have that mid-cabin door plug. So those um, are going to be safe to fly in, in the meantime. But while there is no timeline right now for when the FAA may lift that grounding, the White House Tuesday reiterating that safety is a top priority. The FA, FAA's priority is always keeping Americans safe. That is most important. Uh, and in that spirit, these particular Boeing aircraft will remain grounded uh, until operators completely complete enhanced inspections. The FAA will continue to support the National Transportation Safety Board's investigation into Alaska Airlines Flight 1282. And so in the meantime, like we said, another big component of this story, this is continuing to cause a lot of uh, flight delays, cancel, or I should say uh, cancellations rather just at this point, mainly for uh, United and Alaska. And guys, just remember just yesterday we reported that both of those carriers reported um, that they found even more loose bolts on other aircraft. So this is something that they need to get a handle on. And you think about everything that goes into getting a metal building in the in the sky <laughs> you think bolting the door right wouldn't be the trickiest part of the uh, operation here but the fact that this is on multiple planes now mm -hmm. and what we saw in that flight over portland really it's They're it's trying. it's frightening here you know it's and another headache for boeing yeah all right mara thank you